hey guys fancy here welcome back to my channel hope you guys are doing good wherever you're watching so in today's video i'll show you guys how i make my dokono loaf so let's get into this so first you will need some corn i will be using six corn for this recipe and you will take your corn off the well peel your corn <laughs> make sure you take off all the hair off there like so there you have it your corn nice and clean and next you get a big container you put a small one in there this is a trick to don't have your kernel flying all over the place you set your corn on the top of the small dish like so and then you get your knife and you slide it right down the the center like that all around take off all your kernel like so put it in the dish and then you'll get your blender and you add your corn in your blender like so get it all in there and then to this i'll add some maseka that is some corn flour so i'll just add some equal amounts like equal corn to maseka so don't fold it all the way up to the rim just like so and then you pour that in there like that add it to the corn and then you have your corn and your corn flour and then that's just me diluting some coconut powder and some water grace coconut powder the best and then you will set that aside add a like quarter cup more water to that and these are some of the ingredients i'll be using as well and then i'll fry up some onion some sweet pepper some habanero pepper cilantro garlic if you have any like so and then once that's all fried up i'll season up my corn and my maseka flour like so add in some ricotta powder well i wrote down the ingredients for you guys a pinch of salt uh, baking powder coconut oil sugar I put all that in there for flavor complete seasoning as well and then i use both kind two kinds of complete seasoning then i add in the the fried up mixture that i had there put that in there for more flavor guys pour in my coconut milk and then i added a little bit more water add the water it's too loose you know you want it like this that th that's the texture you're looking for and then you get your loaf pan and also save some of the corn leaf because you will be putting some of those in the the pot this is just in the pan sorry this is just for flavor and to make the loaf comes out easy after it's steamed and then you put i put two at the bottom one at each side like so and then you pour your corn mixture in there and this actually folds it up it goes all the way to the top and then you cover it up like so well you put that aside and then you will get a big pot like so put your corn cobs in the at the bottom put some water in there not too much just enough to don't go over the corn cobs and then you set your loaf pan on top of the corn cobs like so cover your pot and let it steam for an hour and 30 minutes so you will be cooking this on the stove top and there you have it guys your dekono my dekono loaf and it's so poor nice and delicious you guys should give this a try and once it once it's nice and cold it's you flip it over and it comes out really super easy and you leave the skin on while it's cooling so it can hold in the moisture and there you have it guys my dekono loaf i paired this with some barbecue pork chops I hope you guys enjoyed this video and please subscribe to my channel for more delicious recipes. Thank you guys for watching.